Acting like a fake janitor. You don't know about my company? Sir. I've been, I'm just, I've been doing it like, I, like I said, I drove an hour. And I understand that, and I respect that. That's why I said, let me find Ebony and see what she'd like for you to do. Because I'm not paying you. Ebony is, evidently. No, no, you don't even need to be in here at this point. Have you sent the invoice? Huh? He in the, he sent the invoice yeah, over to Neil. Oh, did he send the invoice? No, to he sent it all. You, your company. Sir. Let me get your name. Hold on. Nah, I ain't got time. I drove an hour and two minutes. Sir, to me, I don't care if you drove six hours. You're not going to come in here and tell me that you need to clean up and I got to give you $2,000. You crazy as hell. Greg? Yes. Okay. You sent me here, Cole? Sir. I, I just... I ain't seen you no damn where. And I, don't keep telling me I sent you somewhere. I didn't make no phone call to T-Mac. I didn't make no phone call to your company. I didn't make no phone call to no one. So who Greg? Now, you Greg? I'm Greg. Okay, Greg right? Cole. And the only other person would have called you would have been him. I'm talking. About, I'm looking and for Greg. All right, where Greg? I'm Greg. Anybody know where Greg is? Sir, I just told you I'm Greg. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm Greg. Enlighten me. I've been doing janitor for seven years. I never ran into nothing like this. So I apologize. That's all I can say. So you apologize for, for scamming me. Call. So you're a scammer. Sir, I never call you. How many times can I tell you this? Tell me three more times. I'm not gonna sit here. And have this time say We're standing, you. first off. What's the name of your company? Oh my god. Are you saying knuckles up? Knuckles up is the name of Oh my god. Who up. ever heard of knuckles up? What's the name we, of your company? Knuckles up. That's what we do. We we I've been doing cleaning for years. Knuckles up why? Because y'all have We got cleaners all the time. I okay, have never experienced anyone coming here trying to dictate to us to come here and clean up, and then you're gonna tell us we owe you a thousand dollars and another thousand dollars if you do when you finish. And we're doing all this work. I ain't got nothing to do with dicks, first of all. That's not me. First of all, let's get that clear. Sir, you said you're a janitor, right? Yes. Oh, you're a cleanup person. Again, we don't need a cleanup person right now. We have another crew coming. All right, so you want me to start cooking then? I don't know what I'm not about to start cooking. Look, you gotta pay me, Greg. I bought them line. Pay you what? A thousand dollars. I don't want no issue. You a black man, I'm a black man. Oh, you a black man or woman, first of all. Man, I don't care what you call me at this point. I know you crazy I'm just so if you think I'm gonna sit here and keep having this conversation with you, and I say, we didn't call you, I didn't hire you, and you're trying to tell me I did, and I gotta give you somewhere, and I'm not giving you shit. You know Baby D? No. You don't know Baby D, that's why you're looking at me like that. I knew it. What the hell is Baby D? Like I said, and then they talking about, go to, so we gotta go to Nisi's Pizza, you know about that too, right? Like who? Nieces? No. You mean Nassies? Nassies, Nieces, whatever it is. Where it's all ghetto. And that, do better than Nassies. I, that's all I gotta clean up. That that's bro. sir, sir. No, no, no. I don't know who you're talking to. I need to talk to him. Why you need to talk to him? Uh, clean up my restaurant. Are you serious? I gotta do that too. They pay me. Oh, that's, oh, no. So you over there too? Yeah.